Let's fix audio messages if they're not working on your iPhone. Now, if you're trying to send an audio message to somebody, you have a few different options to get that working, even if it's being difficult basically sending that audio message. The first thing that we'll do is we'll open up our iMessage app here, and I'm just gonna go into basically a conversation with myself. So the key here is to find that audio message is we'll tap where you would normally type a message, and you can see to the right here is a microphone, the bottom right is a microphone, but that is for the speech to text dictation that will translate any speech into text. What we wanna do is maybe that AA is hidden, but we'll tap on that little A app store icon. And then you can see the blue waves, that is the audio message basically symbol. If you don't see that, just tap on the three dots there and then go in here and you should be able to find it in there. But let's go back and tap on that audio and then I'm gonna hit tap and record. So this is all I have to do, basically just tap and record. Then when I'm done, I can press it again and then hit that little blue arrow to send it. Now, if this doesn't work, there are a few different reasons why. One option potentially is because you're trying to send it to somebody through text message or that doesn't have an Apple iPhone. So if I go back here and I just go into one of these random, let's do this. Um, maybe this one, yeah. So on here, so this is a text message, it's just an automated bot, but if I tap that little audio, it says it cannot send audio messages at this time. And the reason for that is just they don't have iMessage, this only works for iMessage. But there is a really cool option you have even if this isn't working. So if you go out of here, you can always use the voice memos option on your iPhone. So it's an app that's built into your iPhone, just open up voice memos here and you can tap that record button at the bottom center here and you can just record whatever message you want to send as an audio message. When you're done, just hit that stop and we'll tap those three dots at the top right of it. And then you can hit share and then text message here and then basically you can text this to whoever you want and they'll get this as an audio message they'll just be able to play it it's sort of like basically a you know song it's an m4a file but basically they can save it they can always come back and listen to it and you can save it on your phone so it's a really great way to send audio messages but also keep them on your phone for records down the road Hope this helps. If you have any questions on that, leave them in the comments down below and I'll catch you on the next one.